this is Sharif who just nailed it and welcome back to my 12 days of Christmas. We are on to day 7 presents, Christmas presents. So that's what we're going to do here today. On my nail I have Beatles number 448. It is this beautiful red as you see. It's great for Christmas. So that's what we're going to use. We're going to already put that on. We are going to put a coat of glue gel by She Modern. This could be a She Modern Saturday video. So we are going to coat our nail. Make sure you get it coated very well so that the pigment the glitter sticks to the nail. And we are putting on some red holo. Hello, Erica. I have to say hello to my girl. So I'm going to stick this in the lamp. Give this a cure. Probably for a good old 30 seconds. I have on my palette here, we are using the bow and the two lines from She Modern. <clears throat> Excuse me. They come off of sheet. Let me see if I can get it. You could order them two different ways. I do not have them both out. This has red and hollow on the same sheet. There's lines, S in parentheses. And I picked the red and hollow. And then you can get the sheet where it's all bows, or you can get a sheet that's half bows, half lines. Whatever you want to do, you can do it. So I've already got my lines cut here and my bow. They are saturated or soaking in the water. We will put on the red hollow glitter color when this comes out of the lamp. We are going to be topping off with Eye Gel Beauty. I have evidently read the label too much where it's taking the name off. So, do your pigment. A little goes a long way, but I do want to make sure I get full coverage. Make sure you get your sides. You want everything covered. Tap off your nail. Look how beautiful that is. It reminds me of ruby slippers. That is just beautiful. So, I'm going to stick this back to the lamp like a flash cure so to speak. I'm taking my palette and wiping her off as well as my mat because there is a little bit of red pigment glitter here. Um, I do not wipe the nail off. I could to show you but by sticking it back in the lamp it helps the pigment adhere to the glue. And there is nothing on my palette. Nothing. Nothing. So, that works for me. You can try it. It may not work for you. But it does for me. I'm going to go back in with the glue gel. Probably should top coat. But I'm going to go back in with the glue gel. Put a nice layer on it. Because we are using our lines and our bows now. So I'm going to put that back in the lamp. Once that cure, I'm going to wipe my brush off. So I do not contaminate my glue gel. And it will give you on your, whether if you wipe it on lint free wipe, a tissue, a Kleenex, a paper towel a hint of red so it's better to wipe your brush off so while that is curing we got our ice cube stamper by Maniology um, I have a code I'm not positive if it still works JNI10 all caps so check that out if you want save yourself 10% of your Christmas bill maniology has got a lot of beautiful plates and stampers and polishes, all kinds of great things here that you can check out. Check out She Modern. There could, could be not PR used in the video of She Modern. It's hard to say. 
But in the beginning of the video, I will have where it will say PR included. Just to cover everything. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Click the bell and click all. That way you get notified of all future videos. So pick your line up. You want this straight as possible. So I'm going to get my... My sub control. Get out any air or water bubbles. Pick up your other line, dab it off. There you go. Now I am going to get my silicone tool again. Make sure this is down and attached to the nail. Then I'm going to get my scissors and trim it off. There you go. There you go. You are almost there to your present. Look at how beautiful that looks. I think we have a smidge hanging off the top. Let me get that. There we go. Let me tuck this in here. Make sure we ain't got nothing hanging off. Now I'm going to pick up my bow. Oh, I need to re, 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 uh, redo. When you are doing the bow, you need to make sure it has something to adhere itself to. So I'm going to go back in with my glue gel. Put that back in the lamp. Did that a cure. Because you want your bow to stick, right? You don't want it. You don't want to be caught doing nails and get in a predicament and it doesn't stick. But, so we're going to go back in with the glue gel, cure that, pick up our bow, and we'll be on our way. Check out Pumpkin's video. She is also with me. Are doing this little collaboration of 12 Days of Christmas. She did it last year and I kind of jumped on on day six and did to the end, but... This year I asked her, I figured, can we do the 12 days? I thought it was a great idea. A great day to do 12 different nail arts, one nail a day. So yeah, check out Pumpkin's page. Let me smooth this down again. Get my stamper and pick up my bow. Slide your backing off, because sometimes they do come with. And apply with your stamper. Go back over with your silicone tool. Make sure it is all smoothed out. I did forget to tell you. To go around the bow, I do score it. I've always done that from day one of using shoe monitor decals that way. Because your nails are curved, they're not flat. Some women do have flat nails like I do. At least I say I do. Anyways, you don't want to get in another predicament where things are not sticking to the nail. So... Score your decals, that way everything will stick and lay flat on the nail, or curve so to speak. We're going to go in with our top coat, and we are going to seal this baby in. I think these turn out really beautiful. And give this a full cure. I'm going to pause while this is in the lamp. And we shall return. Alrighty, we are back. Our nail is finito. Look how beautiful that turns out. Beautiful bow, beautiful hollow. Looks just like a Christmas present. And I think this, this is a thumbnail, but I think this would be absolutely beautiful. I really do. 
You could do this as a ring finger, as an accent nail. The rest of your nails are red. It's all up to you. All up to you. Have yourselves a blessed day, and thank you.